Are you wondering if Crash Bandicoot will ever make it onto next-gen consoles? Are you wondering if Crash Bandicoot's future will be bright? Yes? No? Maybe? Not sure? Either way, I'm still gonna answer that question on a positive note. Although this may not happen at all, it's still likely. Alright. So you guys know who Naughty Dog is, correct? Of course you do. They're the ones who developed the four Crash games on the PlayStation 1. Now, Crash Bandicoot just recently turned 17 years old on September 9th of this year. Now, three years from now, it will be 2016, and Crash Bandicoot will be 20 years old. Do you think that something's gonna happen for Crash three years from now? I don't know, but apparently Backstreet Boy Dash M does. On September 13th, he sent me a PlayStation Network message saying that Naughty Dog is apparently going to be doing a Crash Bandicoot trilogy of 1, 2, and 3. Now, when he said that, I obviously thought of the PlayStation 3, not the PlayStation 4. But as the conversation continued, when I asked how did he know, and for what system, he later responded on the 25th of September saying that it will be on the PlayStation 4, and how he knows about it, he tells me that his brother works there. I'm assuming Naughty Dog, since they hold the rights to those games, along with Sony. And once again, as the conversation continued, he told me that it will be coming out in 2016. 2016. Now notice how in the beginning I said three years from now, since it's 2013 at the moment, Crash will be 20 years old. Backstreet Boy Dash M told me that the HD trilogy for Crash Bandicoot will be coming out in 2016, which I'm saying that three years from now, once again, Crash will be 20 years old. And it wouldn't be bad if he did have an HD remake on the PS4, and you cannot say that something won't happen for Crash Bandicoot. You just can't. Because things aren't the same all the time in the gaming industry. I guess 2016 will be the right time for Crash to make a comeback and have him somewhat really relevant again. Which won't be a bad idea at all. Now, I know what you are thinking. Jeremiah, what if he's trolling? What if he's lying? What if he's just fucking with you? Now, I'm gonna answer that. Now, if he's lying, I won't be surprised, believe it or not. I mean, I'm always getting hated on because of Crash. I'm always getting trolled because of Crash. But you see, you can't tell if someone's being sarcastic through text online. So I'm just going to give this guy a chance. Because if something does happen, and if I don't do anything as to regarding to this, then people are going to look at me as if I'm not caring about Crash anymore. Besides, a lot of people sent me things as to regarding for Crash through PSN. And I've seen proof. A proof. I mean, proof. Fail. I honestly don't see why Backstreet Boy Dash M would lie to me like this, simply because of the fact that I've done nothing wrong to him in any particular way. But yeah, there's my answer to, you know, what if he's trolling and such. But now I'll get to the reason as to why Naughty Dog can make an HD trilogy for Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, and 3. Hell, even CTR possibly with online capabilities. Now, Naughty Dog owns the four cra PS1 Crash Bandicoot titles, and so does Sony. Now, Activision does own the character Crash Bandicoot, but they don't own, own, they don't have ownership towards the PlayStation 1 trilogy, plus CTR. If Naughty Dog were to make an HD trilogy of the PS1 games for Crash, they wouldn't need Activision's consent, simply because Activision does not own those games, or CTR. It's that simple. But if an HD trilogy was made, they would probably have to use a new engine because they're not developing the game on the PlayStation 1 anymore, and they're making this on a new hardware, which is probably about 20 times stronger than the PS1s. You catch my drift? I'm saying that in this HD remake, they will add new twists to the gameplay most likely, because it's a new engine and they're making a game on a new hardware, plus... The PS1 Crash games had low quality, and it would be pretty impossible to upgrade the gr those graphics because they were on the PlayStation 1. You see, so just like how Square Enix did with Kingdom Hearts 1.5 when they remade Kingdom Hearts 1, Naughty Dog will have to start all the way from scratch to remake everything. Hell, the textures might be a little different, and also, why would they just upgrade the graphics, and why would they consume time on upgrading graphics only? If anything, it'd be pointless then, because for all of that, I can just go back and play the original PlayStation 1 classics, because the PlayStation 4's HD remake of the trilogy is really not bringing 
it's really not bringing anything new it's just graphics that are upgraded nothing more Naughty Dog is going to add some twists to the gameplay. They will just leave a lot of space out on the PS4, no doubt about it. But if I'm wrong, then oh well. I'm just not going to buy the PlayStation 4 re remake because it's not bringing anything new really. Fuck graphics, it's all about the gameplay. And I personally think that if this happened, Naughty Dog will have to make a redesign to the character because the classic Crash design just screams 90s all over it. And I'm not exaggerating either. This is the PlayStation 4. They have to make it a little different. We don't want this to be half-assed. We don't want to wait 8 years without anything happening with Crash. And then when the HD trilogy comes out for Crash by Naughty Dog, it's just the same exact shit. Only with upgraded graphics. Graphics does not make up for a game. But yeah. Uh, that's all I gotta say really. But keep in mind that Activision's consent is not needed for this to happen. I'm gonna say this one more time. Activision's consent is not needed for this to happen. And Naughty Dog and Sony owns those games, not Activision. So it's possible for this to happen on Crash Bandicoot's 20th anniversary. I guess this is it for the video. Don't thank me. Thank Backstreet Boy Dash M for sending me this information. And if it isn't true, then nice lie. If it is true, then thank you. That is all. I'm Jeremiah Isaiah. Subscribe for more content. Be sure to give this video a strong like, share this with Crash Bandicoot fans everywhere possible, and let's hope that Crash will make it to the PlayStation 4. I'll see you guys later, and stay tuned for more videos. Bye.